Have you ever wondered what it would be like to live on the moon? Well, India's space agency, ISRO, is making strides towards turning that dream into a reality. A dream that spans not just years, but decades, and a dream that is as grand and ambitious as the cosmos itself. ISRO's ambitious plan is to build a space station by the year 2028. Yes, a space station, orbiting our beautiful planet and acting as a launch pad for missions beyond. It's a target that the agency is not only aiming for, but one they are supremely confident of achieving. A crucial cog in this celestial machine is the next generation launch vehicle. This marvel of engineering will be the backbone of the space station project, designed to transport humans and equipment to the cosmos and back. While the construction of a space station is an ambitious project, ISRO has its sights set on even more grandeur, the moon. Scene script. ISRO's lunar ambitions don't stop at merely visiting. They plan to create a lasting presence with multiple missions. The Indian space research organization, ISRO, has its sights set on the moon, with a series of ambitious lunar missions planned over the next few years. These aren't just flyby missions, they're the foundation of a grander vision to offer moon tourism and develop infrastructure on the lunar surface. Starting with Chandrayaan-4, a sample return mission, ISRO will extend its lunar reach with Chandrayaan-5, 6 and 7. Each mission is a stepping stone, a gradual building of knowledge and capabilities, leading to the ultimate goal, a human mission to the moon. But ISRO isn't just planning a quick visit, they're dreaming bigger. They're imagining a future where the moon isn't just a destination for astronauts, but for tourists. That's right, moon tourism. Imagine looking out of your spacecraft window and seeing the Earth rise over the lunar horizon. It's a breathtaking vision, and one that ISRO is working to make a reality. And to make the moon more hospitable for these future lunar tourists, ISRO is planning to develop infrastructure on the moon. This isn't just about building habitats and research stations, it's about creating a sustainable presence on the moon, a base from which humanity can further explore our solar system. The technology developed for the planned ISRO space station will play a crucial role in these lunar missions. The next generation launch vehicle, for instance, will be key in transporting the necessary equipment and personnel to the moon. And innovations like the radioisotope heater units, capable of managing the extreme temperature variations on the lunar surface, will be essential for long-term lunar habitation. These ambitious plans are a testament to ISRO's long-term vision and commitment to space exploration. They're not just looking at the next mission, they're looking at the next decade, the next century. ISRO is not just planning to visit the moon, they're planning to make it a second home. The moon, with its extreme temperature variations, poses a unique challenge. But ISRO has a plan. In order to overcome these harsh lunar conditions, ISRO is exploring the use of radioisotope heater units, or RHUs. These small devices can provide heat through radioactive decay, a technology that could become vital for long-term lunar missions. But that's not all. ISRO is also investigating other innovative technologies to manage the Moon's extreme temperature fluctuations, ensuring that any infrastructure built there can withstand the lunar environment. With these technologies, ISRO aims to not only survive on the Moon, but thrive. This includes the potential for moon tourism and developing a sustainable lunar infrastructure. These advancements aren't just impressive, they're necessary for ISRO's ambitious plans. As they move forward with projects like the Next Generation Launch Vehicle and Chandrayaan-4, 5, 6 and 7, these technologies will be instrumental. ISRO's innovative approach to lunar challenges shows their commitment to making moon living a reality. So, what does the future hold for ISRO and their lunar ambitions? Let's take a moment to reflect. ISRO, India's premier space agency, has set its sights high, aiming to build a space station by 2028. This audacious plan is not just about constructing a celestial edifice, but about mastering the technologies that will make it possible. But that's not all. The lunar landscape beckons, with multiple missions planned, including Chandrayaan-4, 5, 6, and 7. Each mission is a step towards the grand goal of making the moon not just a destination, but a second home for humanity. ISRO is also exploring novel technologies like radioisotope heater units to overcome the extreme lunar temperatures, paving the way for long-term lunar habitation. 
From building a space station to making the moon a second home, ISRO is truly pushing the boundaries of space exploration.